today we're going to be unboxing my Fat Fit Fun from like summer. And then on top of that, I also ordered two mystery bags from the from that season. So this is what she looks like. I love a Fat Fit Fun box. Like they're just so, I don't know, it's something about them. They just put so much effort into their packaging and it's an experience when you open it up. So that's why I really like this subscription because they literally give you an experience. Fat Fit Fun is really fun. Yeah. I said it. Oh, ooh, okay, scratch and reveal. Damn, even if I were to have won, I wouldn't be able to claim it because you would have had to have claimed it in July. The bag is kind of cute. That's a cute bag. Maybe I won't scratch it because if I am if I won it and I didn't get it, I'd be, I'd be mad. So maybe I won't scratch it and just save myself some fees. This is the Swig Life Cold Nine Hours Hot Three Hours Stainless Steel Stemless Cup. And I remember choosing this because I got two, one for me, one for Justin. Yeah, this is cute. Luckily, Justin's not like insecure with his masculinity because this is straight up pink, <laughs> rose gold pink. But Justin doesn't give a damn. It, it, do it, do it, keep the drink cold, okay? Does it, does it spill? You know, those are the things he cares about. But yeah, this is the cup. Very nice. Has like a lid like such. I like this. I think it's pretty. And acid. This might have been some like little extra stuff they threw in there. Oh, okay. So this is for basically like when you have a uh, heartburn and I get acid reflux really bad, you know, cause baby boy well, can't see. Baby on the, well, he still can't see. <laughs> baby on the way, y'all know I'm pregnant. Them days when I eat the, the, the red pastas or anything with chocolate, I'll be up and just burn. Just be burning in my throat. And I'm just like, Argh. can't sleep. So I will try this out if it's baby friendly and tell y'all if it's good or not. What is this? Bakari? Bashari? Bakari? What is this? Well, this is something. I don't know what this is. Oh, okay. This might be, I might've chose this. Just like a little something. Ooh, okay. Yes, I did choose this. This is a little necklace. Okay. You see it? It is so cute and freaking dainty. I love jewelry like this. This isn't going to go with my outfit, but well, nothing really goes with it. Just a regular shrinkler t-shirt. There it is. Very beautiful. Very dainty. Okay. I love a good dainty moment um and I will wear this on my next date night <laughs> next time Justin feels like taking me somewhere we gonna wear this necklace because it's cute <laughs> it's super tiny I was expecting so you know to come in a little case you know like a little case or something but it's okay maybe this is more environmentally friendly we'll see the next thing that I'm pulling out is a two-in-one digital jump rope I remember looking at this and I was like what the hell do you mean digital jump rope like what need do we have to digitize a jump rope um so I think that that's the reason why I got this. Uh, plus I was on my health journey, okay? I was trying to lose all that baby weight. Uh, and then I found out I had another baby. So I probably won't be using this anytime soon. I'll probably start using it next like spring. Cause by then I'll be healed up if I do end up having a C-section again. Okay, so they got a little booklet thing here to kind of tell you about the products. And then this is what it looks like. I was so curious as to what this was. And I guess, does it count how many like repetitions you do? Wait, what in tarnation? Okay, so the rope part is completely separate from like this. Yeah, I, I, I'm i confusion. I'm literally confusion. I don't know what I'm, I'm gonna have to get back to y'all on this because I'm still confused. I thought once I had it in my hand, I would be less confused, but I'm just the same level of confusion. Uh, We'll try this, uh, well not try it, but we'll figure it out. And then I'll let y'all know <laughs> if digitizing my jump rope routine uh, did something. Baby girl fussing because she don't want her diaper change, but it's like, girl, you pooped. You pooped. I got to get that off your butt. <laughs> so please uh, ignore my baby in the background. She is fussing because she doesn't want her diaper changed. And dad, dad is over there changing that diaper. This is the Freck Beauty OG Freckle. I remember I saw this and I was like, that's interesting. I've never really done freckles outside of like the little glittery fleck freckle thing I did with the, uh, the e-girl makeup. This is so much tidier than I thought it was gonna be. Like, look at how itty bitty this is. And this is full size. <laughs> and I think it's expensive too. I've never had freckles, but I've always been curious. Like, what I look like? Let me, let me just, let me just do some. I think I've seen people do this before where you just kinda, you try to make it look as natural as possible. I might have done too many. There's this one girl on Instagram that is so freaking beautiful and she has a face full of freckles and she is just so freaking gorgeous. I don't know if I pull it off. They probably look fake. I don't know. But it's fun. I think that's fun. That's cute. 
cute. I think that's cute and it's different. I don't know how often I'm gonna reach for this, um, which I guess makes the tiny, tiny size make sense, at least for me. The next thing is from Herbivores Aquarius. Pure, oh no, Pore Purifying Clarity Cream. And this is what the little box is looking like. It's got some weight to it. Ooh, okay, this is nice. Nice glass. At least I think it's glass. And this is what it looks like. It just says herbivore. Ooh, look at that. It's blue, blue. It doesn't really smell like anything though. Yeah, it just smells like typical, typical skincare. Um, is this like a mask you wipe on and then you wash it off? Let me see. Oh, okay. So this isn't like a wash off mask. So I think you're supposed to use very little because this thing thicky thick and you just put it on and it's supposed to make your skin better. And I'll include it in the nighttime skincare routine that you really shouldn't do, but I'm gonna do anyways after I give birth because I'm pregnant right now. So I ain't doing that shit. Videos. <laughs> and we're down to the last thing that came in my actual Fast Fit Fun box and then we'll move on to the mystery bags. I remember choosing this because I was like, I'm a mommy. Like, we're gonna need stuff like this. And this is the business and pleasure. It's like a, uh, it's like a bag that you can put food in to keep it cold. So this is what it looks like. Um, the design of it is pretty is pretty okay. I'm not like the biggest fan of it, but uh, when you become a mother, you're worried about practicality, okay? Is it gonna do what I need it to do? And the inside of this is designed to help keep your stuff cold. So when I start taking baby girl places, okay, Six Flags, Disney, we can definitely bring this bad boy out with us and keep our stuff cold. Practability, practicality, <laughs> I think that's the word, practicality, I was about to say practicability. What the fuck is that? And it's a decent size. It's a decent size. I would probably need two of these uh, as my family continues to expand. You know, if me and Justin decide to, you know, have some more kids outside of the two we already got right now. Well, one and a half. The other one's still baking. It seems very well made because sometimes you get bags like this and they be cheap. They be feeling like they are gonna rip the first time you put some in it. So this feels actually really nice, really thick that it's gonna actually keep yourself cold and then not break itself in the process. So I did get two little mystery bags and they each come with three different items. I'm not gonna lie, I had already kind of opened it and one of the items I took out and gave to my mother-in-law. But I'll insert a clip showing you what it is. It was basically like a really nice hat for summer, you know, a nice little beach hat. Um, my mother-in-law, she was going to the beach and she needed a beach hat and I was like, oh yeah, I just got one. So I filmed a little clip of it and then I gave it to my mother-in-law so that she could have it and enjoy it. She's gonna get more use out of it than I will, at least right now, so. The hat was really nice, okay? It was nicely made. My mother-in-law enjoyed it, so win-win. <laughs> now from that bag, I have two more items that I need to go through. The first thing is a Glow Shot Supercharged Hydrating Serum by Glow Oasis. And this is what the box is looking like. I got so many serums, it's ridiculous. I'm gonna have to find some time to get through all these serums. And it got a little, well, this was a little stiff, but it still does a little doopy doop. This is what she looks like, very, very noise. Vegan probiotics, pink cactus extract. They be coming up with all sorts of stuff to put in our skincare. Like what does pink cactus extract do for the skin? Maybe it does amazing things and I'm just ignorant. It just has a typical skincare smell, nothing crazy. And the last thing in my mystery box is by, not box, mystery bag, I guess. I mean, technically it came in a bag. So, well, a bag inside of a box. This is the Short Stories Macy Blackwell Collection. And this is a 10 piece set. A 10 piece set of what is the question? <laughs> okay, so we're starting off with some spoons, some little spoons. I'm guessing this is for like, sides or like sugars or, you know, little little stuff that you would put on the table, but these come with little spoons. And then we have the top, okay. Yeah, I think this is like something you put like sugar, salt, and uh, black pepper or something. Or if you have like different sauces and you're trying to like, you know, serve a little serve a little group of people. And then this is what the base looks like. Let me put it together so you guys can see. All right, so this is what it looks like and it comes with three. All right, pretty cool, pretty, pretty cool. And let me see, is there anything else? And then it also has a little base that you can stick it in, which is cool. You basically have this. I'll probably use this for like sugar, salt, and black pepper to kind of like just have out on the table, just in case like while you're eating, you need to add a little bit of this. Or if you're having tea time, you can add a little bit of that. Or I don't know, we'll figure it out. I'm on my homemaker, okay? <laughs> I'm discovering myself as a homemaker. So this will be something nice to have in my arsenal. And I like that it's something simple, right? It's not this like outrageous color. It's literally something 
something that will go with pretty much any decor. So I like this. This is nice and nothing's broken, which is a good thing because that would suck. <laughs> that would suck if I got this and it was just broke to hell. All right, now on to the second mystery bag. The first thing that I'm pulling out is a shower and empower sugar scrub and bubble bath. Ooh, very nice. And this is by Vosh New York, V-O-E-S. H? I don't know. This is what it looks like. It almost looks like a little, little carton for uh, coffees. <laughs> and so this is what she's working with. Um, I think this is one of those things where this whole section right here didn't have to be there. All of this is empty. Every last bit of this is empty in this product from down here, Ugh. which kind of sucks. Oh, oh, okay, this is cool. So you can use this on your scalp and your body. So you know how you have like scalp scrubs to kind of get rid of the dead skin? This can be used on your body and your scalp. So you can use it as both, which is nice. Let me see if it has a smell. Okay, girl. Safety seal. <laughs> Y'all know I love a good safety seal. That way I know Fat Fit Fun ain't been in my sh Nice, let's see. Hopefully this has a really nice smell to it. Um, I don't know. It has like a shower gel smell. You know, like the shower gels you see at the hotel, the little, little itty bitty things. It kind of smells like that. <laughs> That's just like a citrus, but I didn't really pick up on too much citrus, but maybe when I'm rubbing it in, I'll actually get those citrus flavor, well, not flavors, citrus scents. It's a little bit of a tongue twister. All right, the next thing that I'm pulling out is by o Ole Henriksen. I think I said that right. Dutopia 25% Acid Flash Facial. Face facial, I can't speak. And this is what it looks like. 25% uh, acid sounds like it's not baby friendly. That's what that sounds like. Uh, we'll probably be trying this out in a very long time, like sometime mid next year. And this is what it looks like. It has like a really pretty pearlescent glass bottle, like frosted glass bottle on the outside, which I think is really cool. Yeah, it's just like a little acid, acid mask. It has AHAs, PHAs, and Scandinavia Rowan Berry. See, that's what I'm talking about. What the hell is a Rowan Berry? <laughs> but I really don't have any skin issues right now. So I don't know if I necessarily even need a product like this right now. Ooh, look at that. Isn't that pretty? It's pearlescent too. So the cream itself is very pearlescent. Ooh, it smells, it smells good, but then it also has like an acidic smell to it. No, not acidic, alcohol. It has like kind of alcoholic smell to it, but it kind of smells good too. I don't know, <laughs> but I just gotta do my research and see if I can use it. Maybe I can, I don't know. We gotta research, okay? That's why we read. And the final thing in here are scrunchies. <laughs> yeah, I guess it's just like some little scrunchies. They feel really soft. And this is from Summer and Rose. And yeah, it's just some scrunchies. They seem pretty nice. I don't really wear scrunchies like that. <laughs> I just, I don't really wear scrunchies like that, but you never know. You know, I might get some like box braids and then want to use a scrunchie to put it up. So I'll probably keep these and just have them there just in case, okay? Cause you know, you can never go wrong. And then when baby girl gets bigger, she might like some scrunchies, put some scrunchies in her hair. This is cool, this is cool. Not my favorite, but still pretty nice. That was everything in my FabFitFun as well as the FabFitFun mystery bags that I ordered. I'm very curious about that jump rope. That one is still a mystery to me. After I give birth and heal up, you know, depending on if I get a C-section or not, I will definitely try out that jump rope and see what digitized jump roping is because I'm still confused. I keep looking at it like, what the hell is this thing? But everything else is pretty cool. If you start seeing me with freckles now, just know, is this. <laughs> will I resub? Yes, eventually. Not right now. I got too much stuff to go, go through right now. So this is one of my favorite subs that I've had. I just wish it happened more often in the year. I, you know, four times a year is nice, but you know, every month would be even better. That's just the, the you know, consumerist in me. If you like this content, you already know what to do. Like, share, comment, and definitely subscribe so that you can become a Febe. And I will see y'all with the next one. Deuces. Mm -hmm.